Hey, hey, and welcome to another Tech Tuesday. This is Chad from Ascension Worship. This week, I'm gonna show you three reasons why you might wanna use a pair of these to connect your speakers to your digital mixer. Hey, 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 what do you say? Yes, it's that time again. It's Tech Tuesday. All right, guys, it's good to be back. We've been gone for a while due to work and holidays and a little bit of illness. My voice is finally starting to come back. So today I am on location with Ascension Collective and I want to show you guys one way that we've been using these. If you're not familiar with what this is, this is basically the ends of a four channel sub snake. You can buy these online on Amazon or a few different other places, but it's four XLR males, four XLR females, and you just use a shielded Cat5 or Cat6 cable to connect them together. Now the reason why that's interesting is because Cat5 is really cheap and easy to make or repair. So this can be a really useful option as we'll talk about today. So let's talk about three reasons why we like to use these. Reason number one, it allows us to have more connections on stage. So we have a digital mixer and a digital snake on stage. So we have 32 inputs and 16 outputs through our digital snake. However, we're using all those outputs for stereo in-ear mixes. So we utilize these to give us another four XLR outputs directly from the console to the stage. This allows us to have our 16 outputs through our digital snake for in-ears and then four outputs for speakers, stage monitors, that kind of thing. Reason number two is it allows us to have a direct connection from our digital mixer to our speakers without going through a digital snake. Now the reason why this could be helpful is maybe something happens and someone accidentally loses power to your digital snake, you now have no audio. Well, by doing this, you would still have connection to your speakers and anything that's plugged directly into your mixer, so your background music, maybe your wireless mics, would still operate and still give you some sort of audio happening in the background until you can get your digital snake back up and running. Finally, reason number three is it allows for quick disconnection of your speakers in the case of emergency. So maybe you need to shut down or restart your console and it is physically difficult or impossible to run to the stage and do it properly. Well, because you have a direct connection that's just going through a single Cat5, it's very easy just to disconnect that Cat5 and now you are no longer physically connected to your speakers. Shut down, restart, whatever you need to do. When the board is back up, again, it's just one connection back in, one connection that is four XLR connections, and now you are back up and running. And this can be super handy, especially if you're in the middle of a show and it's a bunch of people between you and the stage, this will allow you to be able to connect and disconnect very quickly and easily. So there you have it, those are three reasons why we like to use these. I'll put a link in the description where you can find this particular model on Amazon. I believe it's about $69 to get the pair. And again, you can make your own Cat5 or Cat6 to connect them. If you don't know how to make a shielded Cat5 or Cat6, take a look in the description. There'll be a video on how to do that as well. All right, guys, I hope that was helpful to someone out there. Until next time, have a great week. Again, this is Chad from Ascension Worship. I hope this has been helpful for you and your team. Come back here every Tuesday for new information.